So if uh, we go to the central dogma of biology where DNA makes RNA makes proteins, um, this is quite an extraordinary era that we live in now, this genomic era of uh, science where uh, we have so much information available to us. So if we look at DNA, DNA is a linear template of four bases and uh, the speed with which we can sequence DNA is just beyond anyone's comprehension uh, even a decade ago um, that we could have whole genomes so rapidly. So it's a linear template and the information is in this linear template. And the same is true for RNA. It's a linear template of four bases and the information is encoded in that linear template. But if we look at proteins, proteins are a little bit different. They're made up of 20 different amino acids and the chemical properties of those amino acids are quite different. And in addition, they get modified uh, once they're made and that modification can make a critical difference in how they work. So understanding um, how a protein works is, is more complicated. So with DNA and RNA, transcription translates or transcribes the DNA into RNA. They're both linear templates. Um, if you look at proteins and translation now, that RNA is translated into proteins where you have all these diverse amino acids. And if we look at a protein sequence, it, of course, it defines the chemical composition of that uh, structure of that protein molecule. But it doesn't really tell you how it works. And to really understand how a protein works, you need to have a structure so that you know where those amino acids are, you know how they work together to create uh, an active and functional protein. And Understanding this is much more complicated than just reading out the template from the DNA or the RNA. And so I like to think of our present era of science not as the genomic era of science, but the proteogenomic era of science. And ultimately, we're going to have to understand this entire gamut going from DNA to RNA to proteins. And it's going to be much more challenging to do the proteins, but we're already making um, enormous progress there.